bodies of masses m1 equals to 5 kz and m2 equals to 3 kz are connected by a light string going over a smooth light pulley on a smooth inclined plane as shown in the figure. The system is at rest. The force exerted by the inclined plane on the body of mass M1 will be. These two blocks connected with the help of a string and this system is at equilibrium position. Weight of this block is resolved into two rectangular components. Along this direction, mg cos theta and along the inclined plane in downward direction, mg sin theta. Weight of m2 acting in downward direction. This weight is balanced due to the tensional force. And here also tensional force is acting in upward the inclined plane. So, system is in equilibrium means mg sin theta is equals to tensional force and tensional force is equals to m to g. On both sides g get cancelled. Sin theta is equals to m2 by m1. Mass of the second block is 3 kz and mass of the first block is 5 kz. Sin theta is equals to 3 by 5. Opposite side 3 and hypotenuse is 5. Let us find out the adjacent side. 5 square is equals to 3 square plus x square. Then x square is equals to 25 minus 9. x is equals to square root of 16 that is equals to 4. So cos theta is equals to Adjacent side 4 by hypotenuse is 5. Cos theta is equals to 4 by 5. Here we have to find out the force exerted by the inclined plane on the body of mass M1. Force exerted by the inclined plane on body of mass M1 is nothing but the normal force. Normal force is equals to mg cos theta. Mass of this block 5 kz and acceleration due to gravity 10. In place of cos theta take 4 by 5. 5 get cancelled. 10 into 4. 40 newtons. The force exerted by the inclined plane on the body of mass m1 is 40 newtons. Second option is correct.